What's up everyone and welcome back to Pokemon Uranium. Last episode we defeated the final gym in this beta and we got a very important decision to make. Which Pokemon will we get a Mega Stone for? Electruxo or S51? I guess this? Unidentified Fallen Object. Alright. Well, <laughs> I guess we're gonna do S51. I'm sorry, Electruxo. I know most of you probably wanted to see Electruxo Mega Evolve, but I think you can get his Mega Stone somewhere else in the game. And wait, we have to battle Theo. Are you serious? Oh my gosh. One last battle. Let's do this! Orange, I'm gonna attack with all my might using the power of Mega Evolution! You better be prepared! Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Pokemon Uranium. This is the actual final episode. We are taking on our rival Theo one last time, and he's got a new sprite. Looks like rocket power or something. I don't know, he looks kind of weird. I like it though, okay? So in the last episode, we got the power of Mega Evolution. Unfortunately, I chose to put it on S51, so even though we can now Mega Evolve, uh... Yeah, we can Mega Evolve now, but... Wait, okay. I don't want to do it on S51 because this Arkeles is gonna destroy us. Probably should have chosen Electrux, so I don't think there's any other way that we can get their Mega Stone, so... I'm sorry, we do actually also have the Mega Stone for, uh, Drillgan, so we could definitely Mega Evolve him. But we didn't get to equip him with it. So S51, you will be back, buddy. You will be back and be able to Mega Evolve. Holy moly, that thing looks awesome. The Mega Arkeles. Look at that thing, dude. That's awesome. I am very scared, though, because it's probably going to be faster than Electruxo and just go for, like, that uh, Earthquake. Yeah. Okay. Okay, we might be in for some trouble here, guys. Now that Theo's got Mega Evolution, you know, Theo almost beat the Gym Leader single-handedly in the last episode. So, now that he's got Mega Evolution, I don't know if there's a lot that we can do to stop him. Probably should have sent out Kimikonda to uh, lower that speed. That's such a good ability, man. Definitely one of the best abilities, I would say, in Pokemon. I don't know, I know it's not in the regular Pokemon games, but it's really, really good on this thing. So... I already made a very bad mistake, so we'll just, I, I, I guess we'll just try and will this thing down. Wait, it's got Earthquake. What am I doing right now? What am I doing, dude? I'm just letting my Pokemon die one by one right now. This is just, all right. Okay, man, I'm not playing this out very well. Um, it's probably faster than Drillgan too. I don't know, but maybe Drillgan can once again be the savior that we need right now. Because, honestly, we're already down two Pokemon to Theo. He started off with his- Man, if we just pick Electruxo's Mega Stone, this would all be resolved. This wouldn't even be an issue. Anyway, I've completely forgotten. This is the final episode. This is actually going to be the last one. I know I said that last time, but this is it. This is actually the end. We got Mega Evolution. We beat the final gym. Uh, so, th this is it, guys. For now, at least. Uh, obviously, later on, there might be an update to the game. So, we'll continue it then. But for now, this is gonna be the end. So, if you guys are excited, be sure to leave a like. And I will definitely try and bring you some more, um, uranium when it when it's updated. I really hope it doesn't go into the same cycle as Insurgents, though. Because Insurgents has been taking a little while. I know the creator is working very hard on the next update, but... We got news that it was coming a while back, and then it just kind of never happened. So I hope that that comes soon as well, because I'm excited to play the rest of that. Anyway, now we can Mega Evolve our S51A. So here we go, guys! Our first Mega Evolution! It's S51! We're using that unidentified flying object. What the heck is this? Mega S51A. Why did it say S51AT? Is that really- is that what it said? No, it just says S51A. I don't know, but it's Mega Evolved, okay? That's the point. So now we get to do our super duper powered up Psychic. Man, I wonder how much stats we've got right now that we're Mega Evolved. Probably a lot. I'll check it out in a second here. Uh, he's bringing out Bari yet though, so... Actually, we shouldn't stay in on that anyway. Uh, maybe Coatlith can handle that. Well, we don't really have any flying moves on it anymore, so it probably can't handle it, but we'll try it anyway. I just want to check the stats on our Mega S51, because that thing must be super strong. Like, it already had really good special attack. Imagine now that it's Mega Evolved. Let's check it out. Where is it? There it is. Wait, it still says it's the regular one. Oh my gosh. Dude, that looks so cool. Look at the item it's holding. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. That is very cool. 167 special attack, so... 
Not really. Oh my god, it's got Mega Launcher, Aura, and Pulse moves. Too bad we don't have any of those. Can this thing learn like drag? Oh, we have Dark Pulse. Okay, that's powered up at least. Is there a psychic move that's a pulse move? I doubt it, but uh, if we ever find one, that would be good. Could have nasty plotted there, probably. I don't think this Bowery yet is going to have anything that's going to kill us right now. So yeah, probably would have been smarter to nasty plot, but that's okay because it's just going for revenge. And that's... Yeah, man, that's a, that's a pretty strong revenge you got there, Bowery yet. <laughs> that would have done no damage if we'd gone nasty plot. So not my best attack there. Then again, I haven't been making the best attacks just in general in this battle so far. I don't know. So, Coatlas is going to die now. Jeez, man. We might actually lose this battle against Theo. We've been losing a lot lately. Mostly because I suck, but... A little bit of it, I gotta say, is... uh, I don't know, man. I don't know. I really don't know what to say. There's no excuses. That's what I'm trying to say. There's no excuses. So, F S51... Are you even faster than this thing? I highly doubt it, but we'll just go Dark Pulse even though that's going to do nothing at all. Oh my gosh, I'm dumb. And he's got the revenge. I thought he was going to go for a dark move. I, I don't know why it didn't go for a dark move. Can we survive this? Nope. At least he's going to die too. So that's a good thing, I, I guess. But now we don't have our Mega Evolution. Man, what am I doing? I should have just gone Shadow Ball. Whatever, let's bring out our own bar yet, which we could actually Mega Evolve if we had the stone for it, but... We don't, um, I think we're going to have to revive Kimikonda. I feel like the other Pokemon that this dude has, Kimikonda can definitely handle. It's, he's got Trop Print still. He's got this Hair Elect, which is really not going to do anything. Because as soon as uh, Kimikonda comes out, we'll just petrify it, hit it with a Flamethrower, and that thing is dead. So, not too worried about that. Um, but yeah, he's got Trop Print, which we can take down with an Earthquake from Drillgan. He's got, uh, what's his other Pokemon? Jelen. So yeah, Jelen can also be taken down by Kimikonda. I think we're okay. Even with that tail glow. Why do you have spark? What is this thing? What are you doing, Theo? What are you I, I seriously, I, I'm questioning what you are doing because you use tail glow and you go for spark. Like, is that really the best attack that you've got? Spark? Uh, I don't know. He raised his, um... Special attack by a lot now with Tail Glow, but Foul Play works off a of physical attack, so I wouldn't really do anything. You know what? Pretty sure even with all those Tail Glows, this isn't even going to kill us still. Or maybe it will, actually. It, it it still does nothing! Why? Why, Theo? I, I don't know what the heck Theo is thinking, honestly. I don't know what goes through his mind, but he is going to go out to his Trop Rank next, so... We'll just bring out the Drill Gan, bring out the real power! The Drill that will pierce the heavens, man! That is Drill Gan. That is the power of the Drill Gan. Uh, but I don't know if we're faster. Well, we're only one level down on it, so... Actually, I don't know. I thought our Pokemon were super duper underleveled, but compared to Theo, at least, it's not that bad. Hey, we beat the gym, okay? That's all that matters. Everybody that said we were going to get destroyed by the gym... Hey, we kind of did lose it once, but hey... At this point in the game, when what, what gyms haven't we lost at least once, you know? <laughs> Feel like we've been losing a lot. If this was a Nuzlocke, I would definitely train up more, but it isn't. That's the thing, you know? It's just a regular chill playthrough. It's a casual. I'm a casual gamer, okay? You just gotta deal with that. Anyway, he's coming back out to the Jelen. I, I know he's got one more Pokemon. I can't think of what it is, though. Uh, so we'll just, you know, cut petrify that and go for a Flamethrower. Probably one-shot it because we've got the Charcoal item. So, I don't know. I'm sorry, Jelen. You're cool and all, but you're just not cool enough to hang out with the... With the real cool kids club, the Chimaconda, the, the Bariette, the Drillgan, you know, those Pokemon. So yeah, I think he's got one more. Wait, this thing has six legs, I just realized. I thought it was four. Maybe it has five. Maybe that wasn't a leg. JK, that's it. He's got, that's that's all his Pokemon. I miscounted. Well, it looks like I lost again. <laughs> Some things never change, even with the power of Mega Evolution. Of course, you had a Mega on your side too, so I'm not surprised. Well fought, both of you! I haven't seen a battle that climactic in many years! We just- our- our gym battle was like, way more hype. Are you serious, dude? I- whatever. Now the power of Mega Evolution is yours to keep! Use it wisely, remembering what you learned in your trials! I will! Good! I wish you two the best of luck on your journeys! Thanks, man! Feel like uh, I was kinda dumb of me not to pick Electrux, though, for the Mega Evolution there, cause 
I don't think there's another way to get their Mega Stone. I feel like there probably is, though. Maybe we can buy them somewhere. Orange, I think we should all tell the Professor about how we both got Mega Evolution. He'll be thrilled! I'll call him up on my Pokepod right now! How do you get Signal up here? Do you see this crazy snow, man? What? Hello, Theo! Professor, I'm here with Orange! Oh, would you look at that? Orange is there too, so what is it? You're not gonna believe this! Orange and I just beat Gym Leader Varen, and he gave us the Mega Rings! Now we can use the power of Mega Evolution! What? That's fantastic! It sounds like I need to give you an upgrade on your Pokedexes! Looks like you're still in Snowbank, so I'll fly over there in a jiffy! Alright! See you soon, Professor! Okay, well then, we'll talk again soon, later! Okay, later kid, I'm gonna I'm go ahead and follow you because... What am I- why would you just leave me here? What do you think I'm gonna do here? Congratulations! Thanks, man! Appreciate that, so... Guess we'll go talk to Professor Bambo and see what's up. I guess this isn't the end just yet. We've got a little bit more to check out. And then again, I have no idea where Bambo is. What if this is the end? What if we never find Bambo? If he's somewhere, he's probably in the Pokemon Center. Or not. Bambo? <laughs> Bambo, are you actually gonna fly here? Cause I don't I don't know if that's the end. I gotta know where the end is. I think Insurgents had a little message that tells you like, that is the end of this beta. You can go mess around in the world, but it's kinda gonna be it. Uh, which is what I wanna do. I wanna go mess around and try to get a bunch of Mega Evolution so I can show them off to you guys. Like we have Mega Drillgan, we have Mega Bariet. Uh, we can, I think we can actually buy the uh, Mega Stone for Electruxo somewhere too, so yeah. I flew here on Pajay as soon as I got the phone call from Theo. Well, it helped that I was already in East Tandor. It's catching some waves, uh, doing important field work that is. So, it's true, you managed to defeat the gym and gain the power of Mega Evolution. Yeah, an orange battled in the top of mountain. It was awesome. Wonderful. Goodness, it's been so long. Look how much you two have grown. I remember when you were there in my lab for the first time, taking your trainer test, and you weren't very happy about your result, Theo. Yeah, don't remind me, but now I'm glad I have Arculez. We were able to use Mega Evolution together. Indeed, as you know, Mega Evolution was discovered recently in the Kalos region. It involves a reaction between a Mega Stone held by a Pokemon and a Keystone like the one on your bracelet. This reaction is made possible by the bond that you and your Pokemon share. Okay, that's that's really great, man. I appreciate the, the offers, but I'm just saying, can you, like, give me the upgrade? It's a treasure hunt, sweet! Yes, that's exactly right. Now then, if you're going to be encountering Mega Pokemon, I'll need to give you both an upgrade to your Pokedexes. Yeah! We got, we got the upgrade. Now you'll be able to record data on all the Mega Pokemon. I look forward to your findings. Now then, what more can I tell you about your adventure? What? You visited Larkspur's lab and his thugs ambushed you and oh dear, oh dear. Is this the cliffhanger? I can't believe that guy would go so far. Should have warned you, when I knew him in university, Larkspur was always unscrupulous. I don't know what that means. He'd go to any lengths to get recognized and he didn't care who got hurt in the process. That's probably what it means. <laughs> I'm glad to hear you managed to break free and get your Pokemon back. You and Garlic Kid make a good team. Glad you found each other. I don't have Garlic Kid. Okay. Well, you're almost finished with the gym challenge. Only one gym remains, and it's in Angular Town, south of Benissi City. Unfortunately, that stretch of ocean is besieged by pirates. They're really a big problem here in East Tandor. Makes traveling the seas very difficult. Not to mention the East Tandor nuclear power plant is near Angular as well. I'm worried that's whatever or whoever it was that caused the meltdowns will strike again. I ain't afraid of no nuclear Pokemon. Yes, I imagine you two can take care of yourselves. I'm just being cautious, that's all. Plus, there are some Pokemon there that you will need to complete your Pokedex. They're rare ones, only found at the bottom of the sea. In order for you to find them, I have these HMs for you two. And we're gonna get ourselves a nice dive HM. Can't wait to find some awesome Pokemon on the ocean floor. Plus, I hear there are legendary Pokemon that live there too. Wait, is there? I, I, I think there's more. <laughs> I don't know when the end of this game is. I seriously don't. I thought that it was just going to be the last gym. You get Mega Evolution and boom, you're done. But maybe there's more. I'm going to go to Angalore and get my 8th badge. Alright, see ya Theo. Forgive me, but I must be off. I'm doing research on nuclear Pokemon. The Tandor Rangers are trying to find a cure. Since it's an elemental affliction, I think I can help. Remember, if you encounter any nuclear types, catch them for me. I'd love to study them back at the lab. And Orange, I know you're strong, but do be careful. The last power plant in Tandor is in Angalore. I'm worried that whatever caused the other power plants to melt down could strike again. And look out for Theo, alright? Alright, buddy. Pajay, let's fly! <laughs> That's like his catchphrase. Let's fly! Hey! Ah, uh, never mind. I was excited, man. I thought, you know, there's, there's more. There's more stuff, but 
That's, that's it. You completed the Uranium 4.0 beta. Thank you so much for playing our game. That is the end of the new content. However, there are still things to do in Tandor. Continue to explore the region and try to complete the Pokedex. You can also use our online features and interact with fellow players. You can also search for the various Mega Stones that are hidden throughout Tandor. If you like, you can use the multi-save functionality to start a new game and try out our Nuzlocke mode. We of Uranium Team will continue adding new content, quests, Pokemon, and features to this game, so stay tuned for future updates. So there it is, guys! That is the end, it looks like. Except that's not the end of this episode, because I want to go find me some Mega Stones and show off those Mega Evolutions, so... We're gonna do a little bit more, but I guess I'll say now, thank you so much to the creators of this game. I've actually really, really enjoyed it, and I hope that you guys have enjoyed it as well. I know the support on this series has been amazing, so be sure to check out the Twitter of the creator or the main creator, JV. Uh, check out the website, like I said, if you haven't played this game, I really do recommend it. It was really fun, man. The story is cool too, so looking forward to the climactic end there in the next beta, which uh, hopefully it's coming soon. I don't really know when, but when it does, guys, just like Pokemon Insurgents, I'll be continuing my episodes of it, my playthrough of it, like when it does get updated. So yeah, don't ask too much for when it's coming because I really don't know and don't really ask the creator either because I'm sure he's working hard and it'll come eventually but I guess that's it for this beta so thank you all for watching and let's go get some mega stones we're back boys and we're in Venessi city and also girls I always seem to forget about the girls just know whenever I say we're back boys I mean you guys too, you you gals too man see I'm, I'm just so bad at this but I'm gonna check the Pokemon Marts here and Nope, there's still no one. I don't know how to get my shiny S51. I know we did the mystery gift, but I just, I don't know where to get it from. Apparently, that thing comes packaged with the unidentified flying object. Uh, so, that's another way that we could have gotten the Mega Stone for S51. We already got it, though, from the gym leader. Uh, so, yeah, I did a little bit of research, and there's actually, we already have all the Mega Stones possible in this game. However, we don't have all the possible Pokemon that Mega Evolve. Uh, so, we're going to go try and get those. Which is why we're here in Vanessi, because there is a boat you can take here all the way back to Beale Beach City. And I just remembered, or rather, well, I knew that you could buy it somewhere, uh, the Mega Stone for your starter, but I didn't know exactly where. Turns out it is here in Beale Beach City, so we're gonna go do that. Um, but yeah, the other Mega Pokemon that we can get that we already have the Mega Stone for is actually in Flagetta, so we're gonna have to go catch one because... I actually never managed to catch a Flager. I know I plan on using a Flager on my team, but I never ended up finding one, and you guys seem to like uh, Kimikonda, so we ended up keeping it on the team. Now, I don't know what floor was the one that sells the Mega Stone, so we're just gonna have to kind of look around, and this elevator takes a while to go up and down, so might take a little bit, but I know that we'll find it eventually. It looks like this is just TMs, uh, so probably not this floor. It might actually be the top floor. Every day there are different items. I'm sorry to say that we don't open on weekends. Are you kidding me? Dude, are you serious? I need my Mega Stone for Electruxo. Can we change the time of the game? Is that, is that a possibility? I, like, can I change my computer time? Alright, it's Monday now. It's, it's 5.11. That's pretty... Oh, look, it worked. That's pretty far ahead. I made it pretty far ahead. Uh, but I guess this day she sells the Arculus site, which... That's a little bit misspelled there. But yeah, that's the not the right Mega Stone that we want. So, guess we'll change the day. I don't remember what day it was that we got the, uh, Electrux site. Might be Tuesday then. Maybe Wednesday. Maybe Thursday. Perhaps Friday. I don't know. I'm just gonna try and exit and come back in, because that seemed to work. So, let's see what she sells on this beautiful day. Hello, every day we have different items. So, what do you have on Tuesday? The Jungle's Crown! Great, we actually already have one of those, so... Alright, I guess it's not Tuesday either. Could it be Wednesday? I'll, I'll just check what each of the items are. I'm check I'm changing my PC, like the date on my computer. So yeah, I guess if you guys are playing along and want to try this, I guess that works. It's a little bit cheap and cheating, but you know, we want that. And this is the starter that we never actually got to see, Metal Links. Uh, so there's the Metal Link site. Got Metal Code Dust Stone as well. So yeah, pretty good items you can buy here on the daily, but still no Electrux site. It's probably going to end up being Friday. So literally if we'd done it yesterday, I could have gotten the Electrux site a lot faster. But I guess, I don't know, man. It's Saturday today and then I just can't get it. Yeah, nope. Still nothing. Shiny Stone, Moss Shard. That can get you Leafy on, I guess, but... Ah, <sighs> literally, it, it ended up being Friday. The last day that I check, it, it ended up being. That's always how it ends up being for me, man. 
I don't know, so we're gonna go back to May the 8th, or actually forward, because it's still not even the 8th, man. That's crazy, we're going back and forth in time, there it is! Finally, we get the Electrux site. Back when we were first here, I couldn't afford it, but now we definitely can. So that's another Mega Stone that we've got, and we're gonna go ahead and give that to our good old buddy, old pal. Um, if I can find it, that is... Electruxo! And show off his Mega Evolution. Oh yeah, we can also give it to Drillgan. So Drillgan, get rid of that Life Orb, son! You're out to be a Mega Evolution! That one we got uh, back at... Where did we get the Drillgan one? In Snowbank Town, there's like an old guy. And you talk to him and he gives you the Drillganite. And then the Bariatite we actually got in the Labyrinth. So, just so you know, that's where we got all of our Mega Stones. Coatlith, unfortunately, doesn't have a Mega Evolution. Like I said, there's only one more Pokemon that we can Mega Evolve that we already have the Stone for. And we're gonna go try and catch him, so let's head over there. This is the route we're looking for. Uh, this is where we're gonna find Flager. And we we're also gonna show off a bunch of our other Mega Evolutions, I guess. Because, you know, we're probably not gonna have a good time finding Flager, considering I couldn't ever find him when I was first doing this. So first off, Electruxo, our starter Pokemon. Let's show off your Mega Evolution, buddy. I've been excited for this, man. Cause he looks awesome, and there's a Modril. Oh, I miss when our Modril was a little Modril, man. He was cute. He was very cute. All right, so Mega Evolution activate, baby. I don't have. Wait, I have Protect. I could have used that. Cause I want to see its front sprite. But then again, we can check the Pokedex. But there it is, Mega Electruxo. He grew them horns like Daniel Radcliffe, and <laughs> I don't know. He looks pretty awesome. I like it. Some Jurassic Park stuff going on. I don't know, man. I don't know what to say about him. He looks cool, though. I like it. So we'll try out Bariette up next, and maybe we'll run into a Flager. I highly doubt it. I, I just... I'm not very hopeful that we're going to run into Flager. No, oh, it's... It's Kostra. The pre-evolution of Trawprint. 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 One of those. All right, so we'll Mega Evolve this guy up next, and here it is. It's Morphin' Time for the Afro Moo. Oh, my... What? Why <laughs> every mega Pokemon in this game? Okay, so in Pokemon X and Y, a lot of them were like, all right, give him a bunch of hair. There you go, it's mega. In this game, give him horns. Yeah, that's the mega evolution if I've ever seen one. I think even S51A gets horns when it mega evolves. That's pretty crazy. By the way, if you never got the lucky egg, uh, you get it here. Ooh, we have a Dunsparce in there. I think it uh, Dunsparce evolves by learning Sky Drop. So if you got Sky Drop on it, you can Mega Evolve it, or sorry, you can evolve it into Dunseraph. Uh, but we already got to see a bunch of Dunseraph, so it's not really a big deal that we didn't show that off. But anyway, one final Mega Evolution, and that is Drillgan. That is aside from Flager, who we're never ever gonna find, but... What? Is he not? You don't, you don't have a Back Sprite? I, I guess there's, there's no Back Sprite. <laughs> oh, well. Well, he's Mega. Just, just believe me. Oh, maybe there's no back sprite for the shiny version, but then again, the shiny version was mystery gift, so... I don't know, that's weird. I'm gonna try and find a Flager now. We finally found one! Oh my goodness. Uh, how I'm gonna weaken it, though, I have no idea, so I guess we can't really do anything. Oh, we had a quick ball! Shoulda gone for the quick ball. Shoulda, coulda, woulda. But I didn't. Maybe we'll still catch it, though. Oh, my gosh. The three shake curse is back, guys. We couldn't finish off this playthrough without the three shake curse. Come on. Did you think this was someone else? No, this is Munching Orange. This is this is the guy that has all of the curses you could ever think of and more. It's, it's real. I'm telling you. It's a real curse. It is real. I have it every every single time I really want to catch a Pokemon. It happens. I swear. This is a thing. Watch. It's going to happen again. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, nope. That was, that was a two-shake. All right. Flager. Um, I don't want to play any games, man. I like that you look like Simba. I think it's cute. I like what you got going. The flaming tail is great. Monferno has that. And I love Monferno. So I'm going to probably love you. If we'd ever found you, you probably would have been on the team, buddy. It's no no personal feelings or anything. I'm just... Chimaconda was made way easier to find. And you never appeared, so... Don't take it personally. Just just please, get in the Pokeball. Jeez Louise, man. I only have six of these left. Like, come on, man. <laughs> oh, boy. Here comes the, the three shakes again. No. Please, just someone explain why... 
I am cursed in this way. I don't- I have one Ultra Ball left. Why? Why me? Why- why not pick someone else? There's so many other people doing Pokemon out there in the world. Come on, Poke Gods, just- just give me this one Pokemon. Seriously. I have- okay, it got paralyzed. That's what I was hoping for. I should have started off with Electruxo in the first place. That's gonna help us out a little bit. <sighs> Maybe they listen. Maybe the Poke Gods listen. Maybe they do. Nope. They- they don't exist. The three shake curse is real, man. I s- oh my god, one Ultra Ball left. Flager, are you real? Is this real? Oh my god. Are you- no. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Why? Why does this only happen to me? It's a- <laughs> And we miss. And we miss. We can't even kill it. We'll be back for you, man. We will be back. This same Flager. I'll remember this patch of grass. We will find you. Here's all the Mega Evolutions! There you go! You can see them, including Inflageta and the other two that we can't get because there's just the Mega Stones aren't in the game. Alright. Thank you guys for watching. I'm sorry, I am legitimately mad that, that we couldn't catch that Flager. Like, come on, man! I'm sorry to end off the episode on a sour note, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. I definitely did. We will be back whenever the next update comes out. Uh, that adds more to the story, so stay tuned! I hope you all enjoyed, if you did as always be sure to leave a like, and I'll see you all in the next one.